Welcome back to Life's Kitchen. I'm your holistic health coach here, giving you the ingredients to make your best life. And if you're like most people, you probably love going out to eat. And one of the favorite foods that you probably like when you go out to eat is a whole big plate of nachos. But you know what? I have a love-hate relationship with nachos. Yeah, sure, they taste good, amazing. But you know what the worst thing about the nachos is, besides the amount of calories that come with it? It's the fact that they never give you enough cheese sauce or meat, and they always charge you an arm and a leg for it. But in today's episode, we're gonna be taking care of that problem because I'm gonna be showing you how to make your own epic shredded chicken nachos. But in today's episode, I'm gonna be showing you how to make your own plate of shredded chicken nachos that are gonna be so epic, they're gonna be calling you a rock star at your next house party. So if you're all ready, then I'm ready to get another epic video underway for you. Let's get to cooking in that kitchen. This is that tortilla. Oh, you hear that? You hear that? Damn, this is great. So this is how we make our own tortilla chips without the deep fry. So we're saving so many calories here. They're so good that my cat even wants some. A little, a little brown, right? But they're crispy. You hear that? That was a tortilla. Hey, I am extremely excited to get into this thing. I mean, just look at that. Do we have enough cheese? Yep. Do we have enough chicken? Yep. Now let's just get a slice of... Look at that, look at that, look at that. Mmm. Wow. The chips are crunchy, which is fantastic. The cheese sauce is really, really good. We're gonna get some guacamole on here, some salsa, and some sour cream. The whole trifecta, we're gonna do it all. Okay, three, two, one, let's go. Wow, wow. This may be the best recipe I've ever come up with. Wow. Wow. You, you are going to be the life of the party if you serve this at your next party. You're going to be the party at your next party. In this entire plate of nachos, the chips, the guacamole, the sour cream, the salsa, the cheese, the chicken, everything everything. You're looking at 1,236 calories, 98.6 grams of protein, 117 carbs, 
40.7 grams of fat. Now, obviously, you are not going to have the entire plate of nachos by yourself. I mean, you could. In fact, they're that good that that might happen today. Mom, I'm just, if I was to compare this to a, to a different plate of nachos at just a regular pub, here's the comparison. Okay, I did a little Google search for like Applebee's, you know, Applebee's is like a very famous restaurant in the United States. Anyway, so if you were to get a shredded chicken nacho platter at Applebee's, according to fastfoodnutrition.org, one order, which is like this, is 1,840 calories, so 600 more, 119 grams of fat compared to the 40 that are in here, the 41, let's just say, that are in here. And there's 119 carbs and only 78 grams of protein. So we are beating it on the protein with 98.6. We are beating it on the carbs with 117. And we are smashing it on the fat with only 40.7. This is why we cook at home. And this is why we just make smarter choices in the kitchen. Because there's no reason why you should have to set yourself back on your fitness goals by getting a plate of nachos at a bar. The only reason why we give in to temptations is because we feel that this is the only place where we can get them. So if we can make the food that we love in our home, then we're going to save calories, we're going to save money, and we are going to look better and feel better and have more confidence at the end of the day. And that's what I like to preach as a, as a holistic health coach. I encourage you to go out there and get yourself in the kitchen and try this recipe out. This is honestly probably the best recipe I've done on this channel so far. 10 out of 10, and if I could give it a 15 out of 10, I would. In fact, let's just call it a 20 out of 10 because it's that good. If there's a recipe that you want to see me make on the channel, then please leave a comment down below in the comment section. Like, share, subscribe. Make sure that you follow along for more of this content. And until next time, guys, this is Mike, your health coach from Life's Kitchen, telling you that you don't have to live a diet. You can live a lifestyle. And you can live here in Life's Kitchen. Peace out.